Hey everybody! Today is the day that I try and tackle this insanity. There's a lot going on. Not to mention the wall, but everything else that I have here. Um, the game plan is to basically get this entire room set up for tomorrow, which is the most exciting day that I've had in a long time. And that is the day that my little Amazon plastic greenhouse is showing up because I need to get these little baby plants into a higher light, higher humidity, higher, happier situation so I can start getting some plants sold. So basically I just need to convert this room into still a functioning bedroom because my little brother only lives three hours away. So he comes home a lot on the weekends. But I also need to make it into a functioning workspace for myself. So that is the game plan for today. I already did a little bit of it yesterday because I have a ton of clothes laying around for inventory. A shout out to everybody that donated to me. You guys are all absolutely amazing. You guys have the biggest hearts out of anybody. You guys just make me feel so special. And today is a sunny day, finally. It's been rainy and gloomy and cold for the past two or three days now. So today we finally are getting a little bit of sun. It's still overcast, but we're getting a little bit of sun. So it's inspiring me to do some things. Also, do you like my sweater? Do you like my necklace? because I got them both at thrift stores. Just saying. <laughs> All right. So this is where the greenhouse is gonna go. This is a south facing window. I might end up having to get a plant light regardless of whether or not this is a south facing window. For some reason, this house still just does not get enough light. But this room gets the most light out of any room in the house. So thanks for moving out, Mark. I wish the greenhouse was coming today, but apparently this is just going to end up being like a three-day video. I've been checking the tracking non-stop for the past two days. One, hoping that it was going to come early, and two, hoping it was going to come early. But no, it's not. It's still just going to come tomorrow. And then I'll get that done, and then I'm going to move all the plants into it, and then tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. But today is going to be the second best day ever because this is all the prep work. Not as fun, but still kind of fun. Let's do this. Let's get cracking. I took that on a time lapse. I did my mental checklist on a time lapse. First things first, all of this has to be moved. I want to put the desk in this corner. I need to figure out what to do with all of this. I'm not super concerned about what I'm going to do with the plants because all the plants are obviously going to go in the greenhouse, so I can literally just put them on the floor if I have to. I need to figure out a little organization system for all this nonsense because I just have like bags of stuff and boxes of stuff and more bags of stuff and more boxes of stuff. This is my watering setup. I put fertilizer in here and then I fill the entire thing with water because I'm on the second floor. So doing that is just so much easier than having to run up and down the stairs every time I want to water my plants. Um, and then we have all the plants. This is not, not even close to all the plants, but it's some of them. And then I have some of them over here as well. I need to move the totes somewhere else. I think that's pretty much it. I guess that's not as big of a mental checklist as I thought it was going to be. I, I mean, I always have more things to do, but I guess that's just on the immediate agenda. And then tomorrow is greenhouse day. And then I'll feel better about the plants growing up here. And then my personal collection, 
I can start getting cracking on that curio cabinet for them. That'll be a whole separate video. The curio cabinet DIY. If you're interested in that, let me know. I'm going to post it anyway, but you can let me know anyway. All right. Time for a power clean. I've kind of just been sitting here figuring out what I want to do next. Where I feel like I'm at right now is just that I have a bunch of stuff, but I have nothing to put it in. Like, all of these totes and all of this water. I'm just not exactly sure how much room the greenhouse is going to take up, so I don't know where... I guess I can just... I have plants everywhere. I'm not overwhelmed, but I'm just trying to stay organized. Like I want like a little like drawer unit or like a little shelving unit or something like that. And I'm racking my brain trying to think if we have something here that I could use, but I just don't know. Okay, so I guess my next step would then be to either set up the desk or like temporarily move the plant stuff. They both just kind of go hand in hand because I need to... Plant materials have to go in both spots. If anybody knows the best way to store pottery, let me know. Because right now I just have this box. And it's not working for me. Okay. So I grabbed some stuff from my room that I just kind of had. Let's see, let's see if I can make any of this functional for me. Can you see what I'm doing? Literally just a stack of paper bags. Pre-made, not pre-made, I made, and I have not made, moss bowls. Bunch of nursery pots. I love using these for plant snakes, so I always save those. We always have a ton of those laying around the house. And then this I had in one of my drinks in Chicago when I went with my sister-in-law, and I've had it ever since. This is a trellis that I've pretty much destroyed, unfortunately. I got it on Etsy. But... It's easy enough to just bend back into place. It's all good. Keep the nursery pots in the basket. Well, this works, I guess, for... I have liquid dirt, cactus, fertilizer, and just like my cutting stuff and some plant Velcro. That'll work for that. I have no idea what to do with these. They're always very in the way. I have this. I do have another little basket. I could put all this in. Wait, hold on. Hold on. They're a little tall. I have a light that I need to figure out an extension cord for. And there's no outlets in this place. I don't like these in the basket. 
just hide them. It's fine. Oh! This can go in here. This can go in here. Oh! And then it can all just go back here. Now I'm just wondering how long I'm going to keep it clean. Realistically, probably not super long. This is the desk for probably the rest of the day. And then we'll see what it ends up looking like tomorrow. My hair is very frizzy. No one told me? Ugh. Anyway. Oh my god, I forgot that all of this has to go over there. I have too much stuff. Ugh. I need to fix my eyebrows. I mean, they still look good, but... They're not the best, but my day has pretty much just consisted of me laying here. Um, that's all I'm going to say about that, but it's greenhouse time. I've been waiting for a week for this bad boy. to see. I'm not using the directions. I don't need them. I'm just jumping right into it. I'm not talking, I'm not doing anything. I'm putting a cabinet together and that is all I'm thinking about. I'm just letting you know right now. I'll come back to you when I'm done. Oh my God, I can't believe it. Out of all the people in the world, you can't believe it. I'm turning out of my life. Maybe I guess I have to look at the directions briefly. Just a quick peek. Okay. See? Quick peek. Now basically all I have to do is just stack them on top of each other, but I'm gonna move this real quick.
I needed to take a minute because this plastic was giving, not this plastic, the plastic that I threw over there was giving me a pretty good run for my money because I was an idiot and tried to open it with a knife. So scissors, you know, if anybody wants to know, scissors are definitely the way to go when you're like trying to unfold and cut a plastic bag. But anyway, I have the bag down. So now I'm ready to move the greenhouse. I have recently discovered a hole in my sock. Don't look at it. This is west. So the sun sets over here and there's a big tree on this side of the yard. So it gets more sun when the sun is over here. So I want it to be, you know, on this side. I'm just gonna lay it out like that for now. There's like six zippers on that thing. I was so confused. Here it is. I'm excited. I wanted to actually get the greenhouse first before I bought plant lights. But uh, this is all I have for now. Alright, let's just organize this and put some plants in here. I changed my sock. Does a does a diffuser work the same as a humidifier in a small space? Does anybody know? Because My sister-in-law got me this, and I do love it, but I don't want to spend money on a humidifier if this is going to work. And I think the plants will love the disco theme. I'm probably going to end up getting something else and then moving this back into my room. One, because I'm going to miss it in my room, and two... I was about to say that it wasn't that late, but then I realized that daylight savings has already kicked in and it doesn't get dark until 8.30, 9 o'clock. So yes, it is late. Um, but I kind of just like sitting in the ambient glow of the cabinet. I'm probably not going to give you a full update because I have another video planned of everything that is in this now but I can just give you a quick little view of it to show you the final the the final the final product I have my watering set up here prop box this is extra fertilizer water this was the base for this but I flipped it upside down and now I just have all the nursery pots in there and then obviously these are all the plants. Quick recaps. Silver sword, Peru, um, Brave Daddy, and Animals. Um, that's my favorite close one. This is uh, Begonia. This is some Singonian elbows. I have another silver sword. I have some. Anyway. <laughs> all right. Well, that's pretty much it for me for tonight.
for the past three days. Um, the rest of the room is still in a little bit of disarray, but it's fine. You can't even see it because it's dark now. And a lot of the propagations that I have going right now are, are pretty close to being ready to pot up. So that'll be an exciting day, maybe in a couple weeks, if that. We are currently sitting at 71.7 degrees Fahrenheit and 83% humidity. So I'll take that. I will take that all day long. Look at it's purple now. Oh, it's not purple, but it's blue. I can't wait to see everything start growing. And I can't wait to see this cabinet start filling up. I put everything in here and I realized how little I have. All right, well, I'm going to stop rambling now. I might sit here and just look at it for a little bit while longer, but that's called me time. So that's none of your business. Thank you for watching. I had a great time doing all of this setup. I hope you had a great time watching me do all of this setup. And I hope you are just as excited as I am for everything else that I have going on. So, again, thanks for watching. I'll see you. I hate stink bugs. And this one has been driving me nuts all day. All right, well, on that bombshell, see you in the next one. Bye.